Throughout the first year of your baby's life, they need breast milk or iron fortified formula. But at about age six months, you can gradually begin introducing your baby to solid foods. How do you know when she's ready? Your baby will give you cues. Let's take a look for cues that your baby is ready to try solid foods. Look for baby's ability to hold her head up and sit without support. Your baby should have tongue control and be able to move her tongue up and down. It should not stick straight out when you try to put something in her mouth. Your baby will open her mouth in expectation of the new food. Because her digestive system is still developing, first food should be foods such as rice cereal. Mix it with breast milk or formula and start with one to two tablespoons. Between seven and eight months of age, you can introduce well-mashed fruits or vegetables. Try only one new food at a time and give your baby that same food once a day for five to seven days before you introduce another food. If your baby reacts to new food with vomiting, wheezing, diarrhea, or your baby gets excess gas or a rash, stop feeding that food and make a note of it. With your doctor's approval, you may be able to try when your infant is older. This is also a good time to offer your baby a cup. Pour a very small amount of breast milk or formula in a small, smooth-lipped cup and hold it to your baby's mouth. They will spill a lot as they are learning to drink, but that's okay. If you have questions about feeding your new baby, a good place to go for help is your WIC nutritionist. Our tips today are general guidelines to follow. Each baby is different, and you should always follow your doctor's advice as to when it's appropriate to introduce new foods.